What is up, guys? Video Game Jam Poop again, back with more Banjo Tui! And in the last episode, we have tackled on Hailfire Peaks, both the fiery side and icy side. In this episode, we're gonna do this new area, which we access from a bubble. And we're going up. And where do we head off to? Head into the clouds. Cloud Cuckoo Land? Not to be confused with a, an area in the Lego movie, which is also called Cloud Cuckoo Land. This Cloud Cuckoo Land is Banjo Tooie's. So first off, we're gonna drill these holes. Oh, and apparently get those spring shoes. Ah. We're gonna drill these to find these beans. I found, I found a strange looking seed. Is it editable? Uh, no, it isn't. It is used for something else, cause, cause we. So, and we use them to plant things, of course. So this level, obviously we're in the clouds, but it's also garden themed, kind of, as well. Oh, we found a honeycomb piece. And one more should be a seed. Yep. Now we're gonna need these boots right here. And go back to the entrance. For something. Right, so here we go. So we access that pad. We access Mr. Fit. Lindsay and Vitzkill exercise verbal. Not really. Yes, you do, Banjo. Wait, I'm Mr. Fit and I'm really fit. Am I? So fit, in fact, that I, I can beat in three events. I'll give you my fit. That's nice. Is it actually? As you can probably see, even is uh, high jump bars. It's not the best height. Alright, so we gotta jump really high. Over! That. Never... How did you do that? Never mind. We'll move on to event two then, when you find me. So yeah, we gotta do some exercise, I guess. So, forget we Fit, we Fit Plus and we Fit You. Let's do Banjo Fit. Or... Banjo fit <laughs> Okay. Alright. Not for the banjo puns. Now, this this world is also only bad for one thing. There are only two warp pads, the main entrance and inside this mountain. There are no other warp pads. So, that's another unfortunate thing. And what's in this flower? What do we access here? Do, 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 we're flying! Oh, we access Wumba's Wigwam, but also, uh, down here is another flower so we can access back. But up here, Canary Mary! Long time since we met her. Hey Banjo, it's that crazy canary woman again. That's me! How about now how about another race? But the handcart's still down in the mine. Don't worry, you can use this clockwork mouse I found instead. Clockwork mouse? Are you mad? Oh yes, go on, jump on board, press X as fast as you can. Right, so it's the same as before, but except this one's harder. Ready, three, two, one, go. Just gotta mash it really hard this time, because Canary is slightly faster in in this one. But you can still get it done if you mash. Or I guess if you had like a. Or I guess if you had a. Uh, if you had like a turbo controller or something, you could just hold it instead and it would automatically do it instead of like mashing buttons, but still, I don't have any of those unfortunately. I don't even know if there is any for Xbox One. Oh, uh, we're going slow. Go fast. Well, Canary's way behind anyway. There we go. <sighs> there we go. <laughs> and the Canary race is more, the race is more suited in Cloud Cuckoo Land than it was in the mines in... Gorge Man, and we got a jiggy for our first one. Right. I'm gonna do this race again so we can get another Cheeto page. So here we go again. Just gonna keep mashing buttons. And I thought we'd do this race first, so then it's all out of the way. And there's a trash can we can enter. We can also look at the areas we can visit while on this as well. So there's a trash can. Another long area. There's a a money thingy. With jiggy coins, and then what is that thing up there? I wonder. And we have a Mumbo's hut. It's blue Mumbo's hut. And then up here, it's a weird planet. Go up high, high in the mountain. 
Oh, we have a bee statue. That means the Zubbers are back in this game. We have another Mumbo's hut. Oh, that's weird. Two Mumbo's hut. Ah. I think it's getting tired. We're at the end anyway. <sighs> Thank God. These races are over now. Yeah, you did. We've got a cheater page. Well, that's it then. I reckon I'll be off for my dinner. What are you having? A nice warm sandwich with a tasty bag of millet. Mm, sounds good. How about a third race? Let's try and win your dinner. Well, no. You'd probably win and then I'd go hungry. See you around, fellow bird and bear buddy. So that's enough of Canary Mary. We've got a cheater page. And then a Wombo's Wigwam, and there is a Jinjo in there as well. Uh, so, but we'll get it on the way, so. Let's go back on this flower. Disconnected from Xbox Live? What? How am I? How am I disconnected from Xbox Live, huh? Um, maybe it's like the internet issue or something. Let me just check. Like, I can access my achievements. On my Xbox One. Unless it's the 360 thingy. Emulation. And there's an eyeball there. And we have another Ice Cube. Hey, young man. I'm George Ice Cube. Stuck up here in this perilous altitude. What happened, George? I was out walking outside Ice Peaks with my wife, Mildred. When a huge blizzard came along and blew me off. Why not stay up here? Lovely view. I'm afraid of ice. Now, I reckon I'm above the icy side. So if you can give, give me a, sh a little push. Alright, how about this? Just push him. Then. <laughs> oh, but he's on the fiery side. No! Wrong side! Tell Mildred I... Oh, you love her. Okay. And now he can fly. Here. Some something someone's in the air defend your jiggy at all cost But we cannot uh, do anything with these eyeballs What we can do is go on top of this uh, On top of a um, the trash can and we find Not only a zubber, but also a honeycomb piece Let's fly somewhere else shall we? There's a cheese over there. It's like a cheese and Cheese Alright, uh, next up we'll go. I guess we'll go here. Let's go in the mountain, shall we? We find a note up here. We're in the central cavern. Oh, that's nice. And we have these enemies, which have random things in their hands. We get another note here. We have Mumbo's Hut. Let's actually go in Mumbo's Hut because there are two of them, and there's actually a reason why there's two of them. There's a Jinjo here. And we have a Black Jinjo. The Black Jinjo family. Now notice the name. The name of the place didn't come up. Well, that's because he's sleeping. Hello, Banjo. Mumbo have big surprise for you. Oh, I like surprises. <laughs> he's facing away. And then... No, it's a trick. It's Mingy Jongo, crafty shaman impersonator. <laughs> Foolish bear, you fell straight into my trap. I'm not that pathetic shaman you think I am. I am Mingi Jongo. Your worthless quest ends here. As you'll see, there's no escape and resistance is here. And you just attack him. And he's actually a robot. <laughs> my elder disguise is ruined. Revealing my evil side. What you Alright. Now the quick kill you can do on him. It's not just like pecking him all the time. But believe it or not, it's to just do this. Or not. <laughs> I guess it's easier if he's on the ground. I'll wait until he's on the ground. Come on, get on the ground. There we go. So then we just... There we go. One more hit. There we go. I calculate my changes stopping you are now minimal. Now he's dead. Banjo's peeing! Wee! He's got green wee! It looks like. 
And we got a Jiggy on his chair. So yeah, that's the fake Mumbo, Mingi Jongo. So that means the real Mumbo must be in the pink one. Now this is random, depending on your save file. So maybe you might get the nice Mumbo here, and then Min Mingi Jongo might be in the purple one. Uh, but for me, he was in the blue one, for this save file at least. But it is random, so you might get Mingi Jongo in this one, or in the other one, it depends. Right, now let's, um... Let's go back down here. Let's go in the water. Oh, uh, what's over here? Oh, there's a crack over here. What's up here? We can use the clockwork kazooie. Oh, and there's a... There's a one egg? And it's for a super stash. Okay. Alright. Oh, note! There's a sign in the water, in the central cavern. Alright, let's go and get that war pad then, shall we? Because we're in the central cavern. Now, we've beaten the boss of this place already, so we've beaten it quite early. So, ooh, get out of my way. Yeah, we've already got a note there. A note there, so... I think I should get the notes if I need to go to those areas, so... I guess we'll just... Right, there. That's the last warp pad here. But it's not. there are two more warp pads in the game. It's in the last area. Uh, we can split up here. Uh, so first, Kazooie can grab this egg right here. Hatch it. And then boom. Whoa, it's rare floaters in the creature if they're not mistaken. Oh, cool. Alright, there's another note there. So, I guess I'll use Kazooie solo for a bit. So I can, um, do a few things with Kazooie only. Oh, it's back here. Okay. Do -do -do -do. Now, you can't really get up here with Banjo and Kazooie, but what about with Kazooie? Yes, you can! You can go up to Mumbo Jumbo or Mingi Jongo. Right, um... Uh, we're gonna go... I believe there's an egg we... Yeah, there's another egg we hatch here, so... Whoa, no! <laughs> That's so funny. That's so funny, Kazooie. Alright, um... Right, I think there's another note we can get here. I'll get that. Right, we'll just die because I'm low on health. But we'll try and get that egg, of course. Uh, and I'll try and go into another area so we can get... Right, there's another Jiggy there. In fact, there's another... There's another switch we can get here, actually. And you have to get it from all the way over here. Right, I'll get Clockwork Kazooie Egg as well. There we go. We got... We got our, back, our Kazooie Egg back. <laughs> <laughs> and he makes a weird sound. Right, so we got a nine. Oh. It's like we're doing it in order here. It doesn't matter what order you do it. You can do it in any order. Now, now inside that is a Jiggy. And you can actually get the Jiggy early. And it works on Xbox version as well. I did it myself a few times. And it works. So I technically don't need to do the buttons. But for the sake of this video, I'll do it anyway. Um... Where else do we need to go? I want to try and go here. Oh my god, this is completely broken. <laughs> completely broken. You see how broken this game is? And get out of my way, Zuma. I need to be flying. In fact, is there something behind the... Um... Whoa! Yeah, there is. There's a... Uh... Honeycomb please. Uh, if I, I want to try and get it while I'm still flying. But I want to still fly. Oh, God. Oh, I want to try and still fly after I grab it. Oh, I missed. Is there another flight pad here, though? No, there isn't. There isn't at all. Well, I guess there is one over there. So, I guess I'll get that one. Cool. Oh, there we go. No. Goddamn Zubber. Stop touching me! Okay. 
Right, um. Right, that's the. Right, uh, how about, um. The, the egg was. I think there's an egg. Yeah, there's another egg here. Yeah, there's another egg there that we can hatch. I thought we do all the hatching eggs first, and then we uh, do the banjo thing. So then, those glowing things that come out of the egg, banjo can use these. Uh, he, he he would like grab them as if you need to take them back, and then he would um. Right, what, what's through this flower? <laughs> Look at Kazooie, he's like... <laughs> Kazooie's like... Oh, it's the trash can, okay. Oh, we have to use Kazooie in this part as well. I guess it is necessary to go here. Right, I'll use Kazooie here then. We're in the trash can. And that is just a Minjo. I think I've got all orange ones anyway, so... Oh, and behind this milk can. Let's look. Tootie. Missing Tootie. Last seen in Banjo-Kazooie. Yeah, we don't see Tootie in this game at all. Which is unfortunate. We have this trash can here. Good. A visitor? Goffo doesn't get many visitors in this trash can. And that surprise, it stinks. I prefer to think of it as an kind of aroma. Perhaps if you could help me, I'm facing eviction of trash health cans. Oh, oh whatever. So I got the problem. No, you don't have to. Will you help me by killing? Yeah. Got 60 seconds to kill 50 points. So, so it's just these. It's it's similar to the ulcers in um in a chomper's belly, except this time you can use Kazooie's flaps to do this. So it's slightly more harder. It's even harder if you have the Kazooie. What's wrong with you? And then we can just um. We just now it, this is harder with the cheat code because obviously you're fast and obviously uh, it's gonna be harder so maybe the eggs will be recommended for that or you turn that cheat off uh, we need 60 points so we've almost got enough <laughs> Wow, we get it. I need 60. Oh! 50. Oh, I think it was 50. I thought it was 60 we need. I'm just gonna jiggy. Why is it showing that way? I know you don't get a cheer page. Don't you try to do a new game of. No. See you later. Now, there's something else here. I think there's a Jinjo inside this. Oh, wait, no, it's just eggs. I know there's a Jinjo somewhere. <laughs> and also, we got Jolly's Juice, which I think in a beta version it was called Duff Beer. <laughs> or Dud Beer, I mean. <laughs> now, I believe. Oh, it's on the Snacky Fruits thing. Uh, Kazooie! I know you don't like milk, but you know you don't like the drink of milk. Perhaps banjo would. Perhaps honey milk. <laughs> I don't know. And then, right there we go. And then we just glide to the Jinjo. And we just need a few more purple ones. Oh, there's a dead fish there. Oh no, Kazumi's hurt. Oh no. And then, let's go behind the trash can because there's something else we can do. Right. Uh, there's another switch we can press. Okay. Well, we're not inside the trash can now. Yeah, we got the wrong order there. So I'm guessing what's the uh, second to last number then? And if you want to go back inside the trash can, just press the Kazooie button. Um. Right. Okay, um... Right, the cheese wedge part. We need to hatch the egg there. Um... Oh, stupid bee. I mean, Zubba. Oh, we're in there. Nope, we need to get back out. So we can hatch this egg right here. 
No, no, not gliding. It's not time to glide, Kazooie. It's time to bum the egg and until it hatches to its former glory. Right, uh, and then obviously you would usually bring your seeds here, but you have to have Banjo to do that. I guess you can also use Banjo and Kazooie because you also need one of Mumbo's moves to actually uh, make that work. Uh, so... Uh, Alright, so... We're pretty much done with Kazooie's only part, so... We'll go and get Banjo. And get hit, apparently. Um, we'll just have Banjo solo now. And this is what he can do. Of course, if you have a cheat code, you can just use the back jump. But if you're not... And you can do this, you can float. You only have a few seconds. You only have like 30 sec 13 seconds to do this. And if you want to cancel it, you just press the B button. No, the X button on Xbox. And then the thing is still there. Nope. I want to go in the backpack. And, and this is the last move we learn in the game. So if you want to hear the song, here it is. Yep, that's the song. It's like the I don't know what I've been told. So what move we got is Sack Pack. And what it is, is this. We use our bag as cloves. So now Banjo's now a naked boy. <laughs> kind of. Yeah, there's another way you could get back if you could. Still. Right, let's try and do banjos only things. Um, Alright, so. Need another Cockpit Kazooie egg. And we got another, even though we didn't need it. And yes, you can kill these enemies. They're just weird looking enemies. Alright, we'll go on Mumbo's side first. Now, there should be a vine always this side, so you can always climb up here. Now, what the Sack Pack can do is you can avoid damage from uh, these things right here so you can avoid damage here just like that and then you can use this to grab that and then that's how you go over there and then it's a cheese wedge up there now you cannot go up there yet because obviously a seed, you'll need one of Mumbo's moves, uh, one of Mumbo's transformations, rather, to actually activate it. So, you can bring the seed in now, but it won't do anything yet. And, in fact, just for the sake of it, let's try and go to the gold thing, but we cannot! We can't reach it, we die. And it's a long way down back to die, all the hags right down there. So we'll just rejoin Kazooie for now. Uh, and, um... Oh wait, there's more notes in there. Oh, and there's a Globo in there as well. So we'll get that. Yeah. Oh, no, it's just a Globo. And I forgot where the other Globo is. So that's one, but I forgot where the other one is. Oh, god damn it. God damn you. Right, so we'll just uh, go to go this way. And then this will be the Mumbo's hut we'll be entering. Right, the vine's that side. But of course I'm going to fly up there. What? Oh no! I failed. Took a lot of damage there. And we died. We almost got it though. If we respawn back at the entrance. Oh my god. We could use the warp pad, but I'm not really going to use that a lot. Uh, so. Yes. Oh no, I lost my boots. Oh no. 
In fact, if there's another... In fact, let's try and get that Jiggy early. Even though I'll try and find the last switch. I know where it is. Um, greetings, fleshy ones. Well, we're talking safe. Correct. I'm Super Stash Deluxe for Digit's Infinite Combination. But if I it only gives you one pair of combination. Hey, no one. Let's have a look inside then. Oh, that might be a problem. If I forgot my own combination. Oh no, sorry, this one. Okay. Now, there's a small gap in between this area. And you have your clockwork egg. Seeming how broken Banjo 2 is. See that gap there? Just put your egg through there. Oh, failed. It is a bit tricky, but... Oh, I thought it went inside. Almost had it. Right, I'm just gonna move a bit. Oh, just move a bit. There we go. And the egg's inside now. We got the jiggy early. There we go. Because this game is completely broken. And I'm surprised, I'm surprised these glitches are not patched here. Right, uh, I'm gonna go in this water here. Oh wait, no, uh, this is the one we've already been in. Uh, when we, after the George Ice Cube. Um, I believe it's the other side. Here we go. It's, guy. it's that side, there's other water. So then, we can do something. And we can get another Jiggy that's not a part of Cloud Cuckoo Land. Yeah, this water right here. I believe there's also notes down here. Yeah, I see a note there. Alright. Alright, we use Kazooie Solo. To then hit this rock! And I wonder where that goes. And it's like rain! Where does it lead to? Pterodactyl land. Pterodactyl land. Into where Dippy was, so he now has a drink. There we go. He's now happy. Yippee! My poor full of water! Where did it all come from? It came from Cloud Cuckoo Land. Now you can lick your water. And then the water you'll have will be your own spit water. Mmm, taste 70. Well, it did come from the clouds, did it? Did it? You did it? What just drop from the sky? I lied. Just drink it and be happy. Oh, I am. Here, take my old shaped gold tooth in exchange. It's just a jiggy. Now, that is a part of Pterodactyl Land's uh, jiggy. It's not Cloud Cuckoo Land's jiggy. So. So that's kind of cool. Go up here. And then. Yeah. Right. Whoa, oh, no! Oh, God. Right, I need, uh, uh, I, I need to go back in here anyway, so. Is there, any, is there more notes around here? No, there isn't. Okay. Right, so. I think what I should do is. If I find another Globo. Because we also need one for Humber as well. Uh, then we can, um, then we can also do the, uh, Mumbo Jumbo thing. Like, I forgot where the other Globo is. Like, I guess it don't matter what order you do things in, but still. Like, I forgot where, I know, obviously I got one Globo already, but I forgot where the other one is. Uh, what's here? That's oh, just running shoes. That's for something else. Here. Yeah. You can probably guess what this part is. Because remember, Mr. Fit, yeah, you'll have to race him here. But it's recommended with just Kazooie only. So, because she's faster. Wow, that was cool. Yeah, that's where we got the Globo. Uh, but I don't know if I should do Mumbo first or... Humber first because the transformation required needs a few jiggies. In fact, in fact, we'll do Humber first because because I forgot where the other Globo is anyway. 
Uh, so we'll try and do Humber first. So if I need to access it. Right, I'll just die here. Right, come on. The we passed away. Right, we're not gonna warp. We're gonna. We're just gonna. In fact, we'll grab these boots. Alright, I think it was here. That's where. Yeah, Mumbo. Uh, Mumbo. Uh, Humber. Oh, I wanted to jump over the flower to dodge it. Ground pounds work as well, apparently. Go in here. Okay, we got one Globo. But don't go in the water yet! You have Globo! Let me give to Humber. And there's also a Jinjo in here, so keep that in mind. We'll transform first. And it's one of the same transformations from the first game. It's the last one we got. Can you guess what it is? It's a bee! A bumblebee! But this time, we have more. We can shoot things now. And when you go faster, it's now blue. Oh, it's a purple Jinjo. Oh my god, at first try. Because I usually struggle to get this Jinjo with the bee. So with this B, we can now, you can also go in first person mode as well, we can now destroy these eyeballs. We can now shoot these eyeballs and destroy them. There we go. Quick, you fool, pass the jiggy on! And then we have to fight the eyeballs. It doesn't matter what order you do the eyeballs though, you can do them in any order. But you, you have to get them all to then, um, Uh, to then, um, so then you can pass on. Right, I think there's one down here. I think this is the one with the jiggy. And I believe it is. Yeah, because if you have ones with jiggy, you'll get a cutscene. So I always think it should be recommended to do, like, the ones that don't have the jiggy first and then the one that has the jiggy, so then you don't get a lot of cutscenes. I believe the one one of them went up here. No, it's not that way. Closer, it's there. And the, that's the last one. My rare eyeball, Jiggy Prince! You killed them all! Ah! Oh, I don't know why I did that. Alright, there's a crack there. I wonder why. Now, there are a few more things you can do with the bee. Uh... First, you can go up here. And up here, find more notes, but also a treble clef. We can find here as well. Yeah, a treble clef. And then, what's that? And through that crack is where the last of those buttons are. Uh, you know, the Super Snatch buttons. So, if you want to get the Jiggy legit, then the last button's there. Oh, no! But, we're, but thank God we're a B, because so, we can fly back on. <laughs> we just fly back up. And let's get that treble clef. <gasps> Stupid bee! What is wrong with you? Go away! Oh, I'm lucky! I've got that! I just need one more normal note. Oh, it's not fair. Found it. Every note, and we've got every single note in the game. Congratulates us, I guess. Now we need to go up here and shoot this thing. Just gonna. Just gonna shoot it in time. Oh wow, we've got it on first try. Two seconds left. If you get stuck, then it's easier. <laughs> All right. Now we need to find where the zombie thing is, and it's down here. I just want to go down right there. Get down there. We've got a mini game. No. So we need 50 points for like 
one of the prizes. So, it's basically one of those shooting games again. Oh, and we shoot these zubbers, apparently. And you've got a lot of time to do this as well, so... We've got to get 50 points for the, uh, for the true prize. So... No, come on. I've got a lot of blue ones here. I don't know if these also home on the enemies or not. Uh, if they do, then that's useful because I don't really notice if they do or not. Ah, it's a big. Right, we got over 50, so we're fine. There we go. Cheater page. And then our other prize is. Got the cheeky, cheeky, cheeky. Alright. And then. What? Where's the. Where's the page? There it is. The cheater page. Right, we just need one more. And then we've got all cheater pages in the game. Right, where's, where's the jiggy? Is it. Oh, it's on that big one. It's there. I don't see it. Though. Where is it? Oh, it's there. The. B! B! Get the jiggy! Get the jiggy! Again, <laughs> no. And we just leave automatically. I think that's everything we can do with the B, I believe. So. In fact, I'll try and find the last Globo, I guess. I'm struggling to find it. Unless it's around here. Or maybe, I don't know if the bee can do this. Can the bee actually do the cheese wedge? He! You can't get in there as that sort of creature! Oh, we cannot then. That's unfortunate. Oh, I think I remember another area. The, the castle. There's like a jelly castle somewhere. Oh, it's down there. Close to the Isle of Hags. And there's a jiggy in there. Can we actually get that as the bee? Or do we have to be Banjo for it? No, we have to be Banjo. That's unfortunate. Oh well. <laughs> it's going through the wigwam as well. Yeah, have my zines. And then I just need to find another globo so we can do mumbo jumbo. Alright. Alright. Oh, the Globo's there! How did I miss that? Now we can access Mumbo Jumbo. We do the Mumbo Jumbo thing now. Alright, just access the flight pad. Right here. And the sun is in Banjo's eyes. Oh my god. And then, it's not that one, it's this purple one. Up here. For us. There we go. And then in here, we'll also have a Minjo as well. The Minjo will always be a nice one, and then the Jinjo will always be in uh, Mingi Jongos. Uh, so. Welcome back, Bird. We got a Globo. But can quench it to my boat if one help. You want my boat help? Yes. Sure. Just put it in your sack. <laughs> right, and then 
Because we've also planted those seeds, not only we'll have something else special, but we'll also have those seeds grow in no time. So we need to go right here. And then we need to... You can also stun these as well. They don't take a lot of stunning to kill. Oh wait, oh, I've gone past it. Well, I have to go around. Oh. Am I stuck? Oh no, I'm not. Alright. I've got another clockwork because of the egg. Get out of my way! Oh my god. Oh. Alright, get out of my way. Alright, get up here. Oh, there we go. Yeah, we're just gonna be careful here. There we go. And then you go up here! No, get hit from the sausage! Alright, there we go. And then we go right here. Cloud Cuckoo Land. There's a Zobber there. Oh, no. I wonder, can you actually kill him with uh, Mumbo's Wand? I actually wonder if you can. But let's just hit this. Hope this works. Rain Dance. Recognize that name? Well, it's actually one of the unused songs in Banjo-Kazooie's files. In the first game's files. Uh, and it's a song called Mumbo's Rain Dance. Let's reference that. So we have a rainbow grow. Onto the gold area. But in addition, because we planted those seeds, they grow. They get bigger and bigger and bigger. There we go. That also means the other one has planted as well. Leave it. Wait, it's not it's not gone? What if we... What happens if we... Do it again? It does nothing. Why is the pad still there? Is one of the plants, like, not seeded or something? I don't know. Like, I, I could have swore that we planted both... Unless, um... Oh, um, unless... Unless it didn't save. I don't know. Let me just check my totals. Let me check my totals. Objects and items. What? I still have it? I thought I planted it. Like, I could have sworn that it didn't save. Are you kidding me? You gotta be joking me. And both of those places we need the seed for are for Banjo only, not for Kazooie. Oh, hey, Banjo. You've got to be joking. It doesn't save. I thought it does. What were they thinking? Oh, my God. I have to plant a... No I have to plant... Oh, my God. Where's the, where's the flight pad? It's there. Which plant is it? that one. Oh my god. I, I, oh my god. I think it's because I died. Or, may, or maybe it's because I actually died and forgot to go back. Even getting there is tricky. Because I want to I want to make quick I'm a, I want to do this quick. I want to do this quick and easy. In fact, can we actually go up there? Oh, nearly! Oh, we're dying again. Oh, my God. Cloud Cuckoo Land is, like, almost one of the hardest ones. At least it's nicer than Grunty Industries. <coughs> oh, God. Sneeze. Oh, God. This... It's really frustrating. 
Right, I'm, I need to go to flight pad. In fact, let's let's try survival here. Oh no! Well, wasting time again, I guess. Oh my god! Thankfully, there's no extra lives in this game. Thank God. Unlike Kazooie. Jesus Christ. Oh. That's the only problem with this world, is if you fall down, you start all the way back at the beginning, or the warp pad, or Mumbo's hut. And there are only two warp pads. <laughs> Making this even more frustrating. Hopefully it's easier from here then. Oh, there we go. No, not in the... No! Not in the plan. Are you joking? Not in the plan. Are you serious? Damn you, Banjo. And Kazooie. Right, I think we got it this time. Finally! We got it. We got the plan. Now we just need to split up. Well, first we need to access M Mumbo. Thankfully, we're close to it anyway. Oh my god. I thought I did do that seed, but no. It's because... I think it's because I died, actually. Stupid ninja. Go away! You just served to... Bing, 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 bing. Yeah, I keep forgetting. Whenever I do this again, I'm gonna make sure I actually plant the seeds first and then go back. And then go to Mumbo's, I mean. This is so I don't have to redo Mumbo again. And I think when I played my Japanese version once, I actually found out a glitch. I don't know if any of anyone else discovered it or whatever, but I think I, I was trying to pause the game because I wanted to like get some food or something. And then as I paused it during Mumbo's transformation, uh, the game was like freezing slightly and going forward a bit. It was like very slow, but eventually it's, it worked again. It took ages though. I don't know why it was doing that. It's just a weird glitch, I guess. Right, let's do the rain dance again. Then, <laughs> then the other seed grows up. Oh, hey, Mr. Fit. And then, does it disappear? Ah, oh, thank god. Right, I'm not gonna bother going again, so I'm just gonna die. Wow, into the ocean! Oh my god. And go back in there. Oh, don't kiss me, please. I'm not gay. Ugh. Alright, um... We're gonna go back in the seat, and, and we are finished with Mumbo for the entire game. We don't need Mumbo anymore. So the rest of it is just up to Banjo and Kazooie. Uh, so now we need to split up. So then Banjo. Or oh, in fact, should we do that gold thing first? We'll do. Th I'll do that. Um. I'll actually do that. Um. That gold thing first. Uh, where is it? Bro. Oh. Question is, where do I find it? That's the issue. Oh, of course, the claw climber boots. I think. Right. Where? I can't move the camera, because I'm close to a wall. God damn these things. And why do they make, like, coin, like, cash money sounds? I don't know. In fact, no, we'll do the, um... Oh, I'm, I'm standing on the wrong pad. <laughs> Alright. 
Oh, and I saw a Jinjo that we missed as well. Get that first. Right, we're done with Kazooie, but... We just need one more purple Jinjo, and then we're done. Right, there we go. Banjo. Here we go. Right, we'll do the blue side first, shall we? Let's see if we can get over here. Oh, we can! We can do it without being... Without doing using the fast cheat code. Okay. Do, 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 do. Right, we'll go up here. Then we can use our sack if we want here, but obviously I'm just going to speedrun this, so... Ah, oh, almost dead. Right, I believe this one's the cheese wedge, so... Yeah, this one's cheese wedge, because I recognize the floor pattern. Yeah, it is. So we just got to float and float, float, float. Like, I guess if you had a cheat code, you wouldn't want to hatch these eggs anyway, but still. Obviously, I had to. And after we've done this one, after we've done the cheese wedge, we'll die. So then we can, um, so we can easily go back and then go on the other side and do the Mr. Fit race. And then we'll use Kazooie Solo again to, uh, do the race because it's easier. Alright, I'll get these feathers. Because we'll need more feathers for flying later, I guess. Right, this part, you'll obviously need your sack pack again. To stand on these. The problem is, is getting on them. Like, getting on this one is hard. And you have air. You have an air meter. Because I'll smelly the cheeses. Even I don't like cheese. It's gross. Ugh. The cheese is like... <laughs> it's like... <laughs> right, we should stand on it. Yes, there we go. And then, we wait... To go on this one. Thankfully, these ones don't move. Well, that one doesn't anyway. We gotta jump. Oh, that was close. We gotta jump on that one though. The only problem is seeing if you can uh, see or not. Right, I guess we don't need to jump on that one because we're on this other side anyway. And we got all blue Jinjos. And we got the Jiggy from the Jinjo. Then over here, we go this side. And then in here, find a Jiggy. Alright. Oh, we can use not Banjo here. But you have to still go through like this. Alright. And yes, you can take damage from these. So, I think the quickest way I could die here is to literally, like, touch this one. <laughs> well, too late now, I guess. I guess I'll fall down a pit instead. There's another flight pad there for some reason. Oh, the castle! We could have done that as well. Well, I guess it's too late anyway. So, what I'll do, I'll go on the same side, actually. Alright, and then... Up here. I think that flower takes us to the... Uh, castle. Yeah, it does. I guess you could also use... I think you can use Clockwork Kazooie as well. But then again, the Jiggy is, like, high for it. I don't know if it can reach it. So, we'll just use Banjo here. And get it that way. Oh, no! I want it. Right, there we go. And then... Boom! We're dead. Oh, we're going there. Right, now we'll go this side. All right, there we go. Just go here. Don't touch the flower. 
And we just gotta grab this glowing beauty thing. And then, there we go. Grab it right there so then we have to float easily. There we go. There we go. And then we just, in front of him, we just grab our sack on and then, and you don't have to hold the uh, trigger buttons when doing this, thankfully. Yes, we will need a race. And now he'll go this way, but you should go this way. And jumping makes it faster as well, I guess. I don't know though. Oh, we got it. Just gonna wait for him. Oh, weird stretch. What? You must have cheated. I won't yet. So you will steal around for event three. And he's gonna die. Or not. He's over there now. Right, we'll just die. <laughs> and then we'll do that uh, race with Kazooie. Tra oh, I mean, switch, I mean. There we go. Oh, I'm going the wrong way here. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Right, let's see if we can. Oh, we cannot. And where is it? Oh my god. Oh, it's there. Oh my god. Although I don't know if you can actually do the gold... The golden uh, coin thing with Kazooie only. I guess we could try it. I see you have your running shoes on. Do you think you can beat me? Finish line and get the gold medal? Yes. By jumping, you go way faster. So just, just also jump. There you go. Oh, lost. I can't believe I was beaten by a bag of feathers. Take my medal. I'm off to the gym next season. It's not a bird. It's a dragon now. It's like a dragon bird. Yep, see how broken this move is. Yeah, just glide a few times and then do those moves again and then you'll still go super fast. Right, I'm gonna try this with Kazooie Solo. I, I can't get up because I'm blocked from the goddamn rainbow. To get down. Get down! There we go. Right, get on there. I think you can do this uh, with Kazooie as well. Yeah, I think you can. Uh, maybe it's much better then. Right. Right, we can go in there, but can we actually do the mini game? That is a Minjo, by the way. Right, so first, we gotta. We gotta actually put eggs in these things. I think first person's the only one to work. Right, that's the grenade egg. That's the ice eggs. Just pooping in the work. No, it just recollects them. <laughs> yeah, that one's the. Right, that's the blue egg. And then this last one's the fire egg, which we have infinite. There we go. And then it's one of those infinite egg things again. Oh yeah, so you can do this with uh, Kazooie Solo. But first we'll grab more eggs here. I need more grenade eggs, of course. And then let's get more ice eggs. And if the eggs reappear, we'll get... Welcome, you're in my favorite to go party shooting challenge. At least 75 jiggies. 90, then an extra prize. So we want to get 90. Uh, fancy a go, yes. So right here, I recommend just... 
just slightly move in the camera and just do this. Yeah, it's easy to do it like this. It's only harder because you might move faster if you go down more. Okay, I think we got it. We just need 90. There we go. We could try and hit more here. Try and get 100. Oh, we almost got 100. Did you cheat? Yes, you must have. You somehow got 98 Jiggies. So we got a Cheeto page. And a Jiggy. So we got every Cheeto page in the game. Still need a few more Jiggies. You might have all my prizes, but... No. Get lost then. This game's too good for you anyways. Alright, right, there we go. And you collect those eggs again if you do want to play. And the Jinjo's back. I mean, the Minjo's back. So we can kill it. So yes, you can do this with Kazooie only. You just... You're just not expecting to a lot of times anyway. Oh, and we died. Okay, let's rejoin. Now, what Jiggies do I need to get now? How many? Oh! I found, I've actually finished Cloud Cuckoo Land. Without even realizing. Oh my god. And under an hour as well. But obviously, it's going to hit an hour mark whenever we try to leave. And I also want to show off how you get the uh, other... Um, the other uh, switch as well. The other button. So yeah, we've done all those. So yeah, Cloud Cuckoo Land was actually easier than the others. So... But first, I'll show off where that button is, shall I? First, I'll warp. Even though I don't need to hit the button now, I'll still show it off anyway. The way you get it. So, obviously, we, we saw the crack thing already. Well, not the crack thing. The So, when we got the treble clef, we saw it with uh, the B, right? Well, it's there. You just gotta get it somehow. Uh... So you just gotta fly up there with Banjo and Kazooie. So we just gotta uh, fly up there. We gotta fly, 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 and then it's right there. Then <laughs> we got hit. That's so funny. Right, and and the camera. Yeah, and you must be careful here as well. Well, I guess you could kill that bee. Make things easier. Oh, he's not dead. Takes a few more hits. Come on, kill the bee! There we go. He's all the way down there. And then, we just use this advantage to go up here and then... Then just spit the clockwork because we get there. And then the switch is just here. And then BOOM! That is where the last switch is. And the year is 1984. Oh yeah, 1984. I should have remembered that. It's a real rare date. Yeah, I think it's when uh, Saber Wolf came out. Right, I'm gonna die here. Or not. Right, wait for these enemies. Whack me. <laughs> Alright, there we go. We're finished here. So we go back down, all the way back down to the Isle of Hags. Because we have done Cloud Cuckoo Land. We've actually. Oh, whoa, no! What the hell? Are you serious? <laughs> Come on, guys. We're not doing this again. Get back in the bubble. We're not doing this again. No, no, no. We're going back down. I didn't meant to press. I didn't meant to touch the bubble. Oh my god. And the feathers are there again, I guess. I guess we're getting the feathers twice then. <laughs> okay. 
Right, the only ones we need left are the Jinjos. Oh, and I believe a few more Jiggies as well. So we got... Obviously, there's one more Jinjo to get, and it's in the Isle of Hags. I forgot where it was, though. Oh, yeah, I think it was... Oh, wait, no, it's not on top of the Grunty Industries entrance. Uh, we've got everything in Spiral Mountain, besides the cheat codes, of course. We've got everything in Mayhem Temple, uh, Glitter Gulch Mine, Witchy World, Jolly Rogers Lagoon, except for that Jiggy, but you have to go to Hailfire Peaks for that. Pterodactyl Land, we've got everything. Grunty Industries, there's only one more thing. There's one more Jiggy. Uh, Hellfire Peaks is complete, and obviously Cloud Cuckoo Land, which was just done now, is fully complete as well, so... So, quite a few things we need to do, so... I guess we'll go to Hellfire Peaks first. At the clifftop. So, we need to go to Hellfire Peaks. Now, this Jiggy is uh, Jolly Rogers Lagoon's Jiggy. Uh, it's those pigs, remember? Uh, so... We need Banjo Solo. Right here. And the Banjo Solo must go this way. And then... Although he can swim in here now, it's free now. But... You still want to go like this to press the switch down there. Right, that, 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 there we go. And where does the water go? Into Jolly Rogers Lagoon there. That is where you get the um, Jiggy from. So we got everything here. So that everything's complete in Jolly Rogers Lagoon then. Oh, and I, I didn't know there were feathers up there. I never knew that before. That's cool. Right, we're leaving this place for good. No more fire and ice world. Right, next up, I believe it was, um, was it Grunty Industries. Oh, yeah, it was. And then it's just one more Jinjo. Oh, I think I know where the Jinjo is. It's up there. Is it? I don't know. Now, you usually use the Claw Climber boots up here. But I'm going to try. Yep, it is up there. Right, I'm going to try with this, though. Free. Uh, if it's even possible. But not like that. Right, I guess if I'm far away, and then, right here, oh, it's a purple Jinjo. What? I don't think it is. Hold on. Right, last chance here. Last chance here. Can we get it? One, two, three, go! Oh, nope. I don't think it is. We need the Claw Climber boots, which we get where Hailfire Peaks is. I keep forgetting this. And then... We use that to get up there. Oh, not there. And then we just go here. So, Pope for him. <coughs> oh, boy. And then we go up here. And then we got the Jinjo. Got it. All right. And one more Jiggy, and we're getting that in Grunty Industries. Which is all the way in the Quagmire. So every other Jinjo in the game now is just a Minjo, so... You've been warned. I guess. All right, here we go. Grunty Industries, the one I hate the most. Thankfully, I know where that Jiggy is. It's not one that I tried to do the glitch with Kazooie, but I couldn't because I, they fixed it in the Xbox Live Arcade version. Uh, it's uh, So after the Jiggy, we fight a uh, welder in, in the aircon plant. We then go this way. 
then. Do 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 dee 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 ding dong dong. Right. Then we go to the waste disposal plant. Right, I need more blue eggs. I want to refill my blue eggs. There we go. Uh, so... And also, you can actually try and swim in it, but... And you'll hear a bit of the aquatic music. Until then... Nope. So then you have to use Banjo to go down here. Whoa! That was interesting. And then you get the Jiggy there. And that's all Jiggies in the game. <laughs> I like how we're still swimming there. Right. right, how much health have we got? Uh, we've not got a lot. I guess I'll just die out of here. So, because it's quicker. Right, let's try this. Yeah, that is kind of a quick dive, but it's not like how it was before. And we're still drowning. And we're out of here. No more Grunty Industries. I hate that place. Give him a profile offline. Retry. What? What? Are you kidding me? Give him a profile is currently offline. Just send your score to the leaderboard. Nah, continue offline. I guess I'm disconnected from the internet, apparently. I don't know. For some reason, it's one of those Xbox bugs. I guess. Right, um... Uh, we'll do a few other things before we end the video off. Because I thought we will just focus on the last area in the next video. We'll do the last Jiggy Wiggy puzzle. There's also a bonus one, but I'm not going to do that one. I'm not going to bother doing that one. <sighs> last Jiggy Wiggy puzzle. Go here. And we need to do all of the puzzles. We need to do all of the Jiggies. Hopefully it's not really a hassle though. And this is for the final boss of the game. So meaning the final boss has its own has its own entrance as well, apparently. Even though it's in the same area as the last area. So Oh no, it was there. I couldn't see banjo on that. Oh yeah, that's the uh, the sucking room. That's the um, the blowing sucking room uh, where they suck human lives and then uh, they try to do it to Grunty, but they fail, I guess. There we go. We've done it quick. Completed Jiggly Wiggy Challenge Ten. No, the Great One will show you. Yeah, got it. Cauldron Keep, so this is the last area. And now we can access the final boss, and there's also a warp pack there. Excellent! You have proved yourself worthy by opening all the doors! A super special challenge now awaits, one that no reward, yet is great as of all. Recipe if you wish to try it. Nah, I'm not going to. So, we've got every single Jiggy in the game. There's only 90 in this game, unfortunately, so there's no 100. So... Right. Kill him, because he deserves a beating up. And then, uh... Let's go to back to the Jinjo village and let's go into a Jinjo house. Let's say the black one because ready, 
Ready? One, two, three. Whee! Yep, you get the loudest sound ever here. Along with happy music this time, because there's lots of Jinjos. Yeah, you only get the happy music if uh, all Jinjos are in the house. If they're all the same colour, at least. And you've got all the Jinjos, then you'll get that one. If there's not all Jinjos, or if there's no Jinjos at all, then you get the sad version. So... Right, we'll go back to Spiral Mountain. Uh... uh <laughs> whoa! What was that kind of a jump there? Alright, um... Alright, we'll actually go and get those cheat codes. From Cheeto! From Cheeto. And we're gonna get that introduction again, because we've not even been on this file. Yep. Yeah, yeah, we know who you are. Just hand over something here, it's fine. You are to look there, I'm afraid. Good to written all of my pages because I helped you in the last game. I'd be most grateful if you could uh, find them on your channels. Maybe? What's happening first? Well, for every five pages you return, I'll let you in so you can dig You mean cheat? Well, I'm not called Cheeto for nothing. Great, you've got enough pages for me to tell you you can cheat. About time, spill the beans. Head it over my precious pages first. Much obliged. My first cheat is feathers. Got it? Second cheat is eggs. Got it? My third cheat is foolproof. Got it? Much obliged. My fourth cheat is honeyback. Got it? And then my fifth and last cheat is jukebox. Got it? Here's a small clue of how to activate the cheat. Go to Bayon Temple Code Chamber letters. Got it. Oh, I still don't understand. I do, Banjo. Come on, let's go and use that cheat. This is a menu of the codes I have told you. Yeah, so there's only five codes you get from Cheeto, unfortunately. The other cheat codes you have to, they are actually a secret and they're not really intended. And here's another secret we forgot to show off. Right here, use a grenade egg all the way there. And this is where you access another Nintendo 64 cartridge game pack. Right down there. So, now... We're pretty much done with Spiral Mountain, so... We'll go and enter these cheat codes and then we'll end the video off, shall we? Yes, we shall. You and me. We'll do it together. No, no, in the wooded hollow. And then... <coughs> Oh, in fact, actually, should we try and get that secret sheet from uh, Witchy World? So then uh, we can ent we can try and enter that as well. We'll try and get that. If not, then don't matter. We'll try and get it though. Right. So what we'll do? We'll go behind the circus. Right. Right over here. Right here. Let's see if we can get the secret cheat code. You want an extra grenade eggs? Oh. Well, I needed an extra anyway. Because <laughs> I used one. We need some red feathers. Okay. You want an extra bar refill? Didn't really need that. Wait a bit. No! No, no, not breathing fire. We go in there. But, oh my god. Like, this, this cheat code is, like, random. Like, most of the time, you'll not even get it. Because it's random. Gonna be Are you serious? I guess we're gonna sit here all day then. Oh no, it's closed. We'll have to get it next time then. So I wanna try and show it off. Uh in my playthrough. If I can. I don't know though. So Right. Right, let's go back to my end temple. Do, 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 do. Uh, 
what it hollow go back to mayhem temple to enter those cheat codes because i thought if we got this secret code we can enter that along with the others so near wamba then we go this way in the j snake grove then we go here and then and then we got to enter so first it was feathers i think the fevers all right feathers Right, there we go. Nice shooting! Go across the cheat. Right. right. I know. Feathers cheat will double the maximum. Yeah, I know. Right, so the next one is eggs. Which is the shortest we'll enter. There we go. The eggs cheat will double the maximum number of eggs you can carry. Alright, next was fallback. Wait, what? Oh, no, it was foolproof. It's foolproof. Oh. Thought it was fallback. Foolproof. Alright, where's the R? There it is. I like how at the top there it's spelled arse backwards. That's so funny. Oh, thank God. Where's the F? Where's the F? I get to see it. Oh, it's there. So I've already entered it. Full fruit cheat will keep you the one. And then it's honey back. And if you have the homing cheat, it's gonna be annoying with these enemies. So you're gonna home in on these enemies rather than what you're actually aiming at. And sometimes it might go on a letter you don't want it to touch. And then Where's the where's the C? There it is. Alright. The honey bag cheat will automatically replenish health over time. Okay, and then the last one, well legit one, is jukebox. Jukebox. Where's the jukebox. The jukebox cheat will activate the jukebox at Jolly's. Yeah, that's every cheat here. No! I wanted talent shot mode. Okay. No. Turn it on! Alright. Yeah, we got these cheats. Now, the five cheats are the uh, legit ones, along with the uh, 12th one, the homing eggs. The numbers before 12, well, before 11, which is actually uh, the secret one we're trying to get, is uh, the ones before that and after five. Are the Ill, are the uh, secret ones you not so, that they the developers didn't intend? But of course, if you make them work on Xbox, uh, your score will not be saved to leaderboard, and saving is disabled. So, in fact, shall I try that uh, wishy world thing again? If not, then I'll end the video off. Let's try that witchy world thing again. If not, then we'll do it in the next video. Right, here we go. No food. But I don't get... Stand on it! Yeah, we've got more gold feathers now. We've got 20 now. Right. Let's see. We had some red feathers. Didn't need them. See, we've got 200 feathers as well. We an extra grenade eggs. We've got 50 grenade eggs now. You can see that right there. Alright. There's a gold feathers. Oh my god. Please give me the cheat code. Come on. An extra fire eggs. I didn't need those. Got 100 then. You got 100 ice eggs as well, so. And you'll have 20 uh, clockwork eggs. Wait a bit.
Oh, it's closed. Well, I guess I'll have to do it in the next video then. So, uh, next time in Banjo Kazooie, we'll we'll tackle on uh, the Cauldron Keep. Uh, so, I guess I'll see you guys next time. Video game, Jane Pippers out. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.